it's Chris from Tranquility Homes, and here we are at Forest Gate. You might remember, it's a good few months ago now, we sold this property to a couple and they were very interested in the potential of it. Um, we helped them with some plans and we helped them to start to realize their dream. And we've got some really exciting news as well, uh, which our director, Adam, is going to be going into. Um, but yeah, why don't we uh, see what's going on? And we're really excited to be here today to just show you what we're going to be doing with this project and to also launch our next venture, which I'm really hoping is going to be a great support for the uh, for Chris and the sales team and also for our, our lettings teams and landlords in general. So what we've decided to do is, we, from, from the work and things we, we've been doing, we've got a lot of demand from clients saying, you know, we're, we're really struggling to find good quality builders that can build these projects. We want to buy them off you, but we're, we're struggling with the, uh, with, with the build side of it. So what, what we've done is we've teamed up with a local builder and we've, we've launched Landlord Building Solutions, which is going to be a niche product just targeted at our existing clients, so our landlords, people we've sold houses to or worked with in the past, to uh, help them develop their projects and develop their, their, their kind of aspirations and dream, dream homes really. So we're really excited to be, this is the, the, the kind of the, the launch of it today um, and we want to show you what we've been doing with this first project. This is really exciting and it's going to open up so many more opportunities for both our vendors and our clients. Um, I'm quite excited to see how this one's going to turn out. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go in and have a look. So here we are in the original living room and one of the things that we loved about this house when we listed it was the potential of opening up this whole space um, and so we're going to have a quick chat with Adam and he's going to talk us through some of the details and the plans that we've got because the new owners are going to totally remodel the internals of this house. It's going to be incredible when it's done. So yeah Adam, what's the plan in here? Yeah, so we're in the existing lounge at the moment, so it's got two reception rooms downstairs. So you've got the front reception room, which we're leaving as it is for now. Uh, we're in the rear reception room here. So like you said, you know, open plan living is the kind of the modern way and it, it, it really, having a family area that's functional for everyone is like a, a real big bonus um, when we're coming to selling houses, isn't it? So, <laughs> you know, that, that's one thing that we're going to do in here. So at the moment, we've got a wall in between the living room and the kitchen. So we're going to be knocking all this out, putting new RSJs up to uh, to strengthen, make sure all the, the structure and everything's keep uh, keep strengthened. Mm -hmm. um, and I'm guessing then that's going to be a big job. What's the sort of time frame you're looking at for this? Yeah, so we started this project only on Tuesday, so it's Friday today. So we've been on it three days. So at the <laughs> moment it's kind of operation rip out. Um, we'll be t looking to take down the walls and things next week wow. um, as well. So okay. the project's going to move at quite a pace. I think within the next eight to 12 weeks, we're hoping we're going to be, be, be done in here. Um, so but the, for the first kind of two or three weeks, it's all about um, ripping out. We're going to be yeah, taking this wall out. There's a utility at the back there as well. We're going to be uh, we're taking the roof off of that. We're building that up a little bit because it was quite a, a narrow flat roof. So we're making a bit more height in there. Mm. So going to be uh, downstairs toilets in there, good size utility room, and then there's going to be a nice kind of L-shaped kitchen we're going to put in as well. Ugh, I can't wait to see it. <laughs> so here we are in the original kitchen. Mm -hmm. um, as you can see, we're all ripping it out at the minute. But Adam, what's the plan in here then? Yeah, so in here, when we were in the living room, I talked about we're going to take this wall out. Mm -hmm. So this wall is all going to come out, and most of this wall here is going to come out. So we're just going to go out into the hallway a little bit, just to create a little bit more space, mm -hmm. and kind of square off this room a little bit more. Um, so one of the main things that the owners have noticed since they moved into this house is the boiler, t the heating system was a really old system, and they've been noticing how much they've been spending on utility bills. Mm -hmm. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be insulating all of the exterior walls, and then also we're going to be digging down into the floors, we're going to be insulating the floors um, and then there's going to be underfloor heating that's going to go over on top of that as well. <laughs> that's so, so cool. Yeah, it should be a, a real nice finish. So, With the kitchen as well, the kitchen is going to come along here on the right. It's going to come all around here and around to here. So they've uh, chosen quite a nice high spec kitchen that we, we help them source and we're going to be we're looking at kind of some marble worktops as well to really finish that off. So. I like the sound of this. <laughs> so what about the rest of the house? Are there any other plans? Yeah, so with the rest of the house, while the owners aren't here at the moment, because you can imagine 
they're a young family they can't be uh, can't be living in the, in this kind of mess so uh, so we're taking the opportunity as well at the same time to fully rewire the whole house and uh, put a new whole new uh, heating system and new boiler into the house as well nice. um, again the uh, the emphasis is really on uh, trying to put some en energy saving measures in there and help cut those utility costs so kind of from a longevity point of view they're going to have a much more sustainable house as well as a, a nice brand spanking new house mm. yeah very topical at the minute of course as well um, yeah. so yeah this sounds very exciting um, and you reckon 12 weeks we might be there Somewhere in that kind of that kind of ballpark, um, <laughs> oh. it, it all depends on the on, on the trades and everything coming in to get the job finished. Uh, um, but yeah, that's the kind of timescales we're we're looking at. So uh, we've got another few bits that we're we're doing as well that I've not mentioned actually. So we're back in the lounge. We're putting some double doors in there to look out on this lovely garden. Um, there's going to be a new door in the utility area as well. So uh, yeah, a couple of other bits that are being done at the same time. Well, if that's okay with you, maybe you can invite us back in about two weeks and we'll see where we're at with it then. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, that would be great. So, uh, <laughs>so big thanks to Adam to inviting us no and thank you for watching what is going to be our latest series on our development project on this substantial home in Anstey and of course um, I'll leave the last word to Adam he can tell you again about our exciting new venture working with our clients and vendors um, to bring their property dreams to life yeah thanks again for watching and uh, yeah we're looking forward to uh, to working with a lot of you out there to hopefully help you uh, you grow your property portfolio so thanks for watching and see you again soon